Hey folks and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I want to talk about some issues that I've had um, with my uh, Volcom Brat and how I am taking care of them. Uh, let's begin with um, the horn. So the horn, I took it over to the dealership. Let me show you exactly what's happening to the horn. It was working for a little bit, then all of a sudden it just stopped working. And let me flip it around so you can see. This is the button that you use. See, when I depress it, it, it's trying to make noise. Like I can hold it down, the diaphragm. And it doesn't want to work. And the dealership tried to adjust. There's like a little nut in the back. They try to adjust it a little bit to see if it works. And it wasn't working at all. So um, they, they, they're the ones who submitted the uh, warranty uh, paperwork. Uh, I don't want to mention the dealership's name. Um, I don't want to put a plug for them. Uh, anyway, moving forward, after after that, the brake started squeaking, and I found out that it was the rear brakes. The pads were um, it, they appeared like they were contaminated, and they started to crumble. And the squealing got worse over time. I noticed that the uh, the the uh, caliper themselves these two nuts right here you can loosen them up and you can align this piece this is just an adapter uh, but yeah you can align the pieces and i did that to see if it alleviated uh based um on the it's per the service manual that volcon gave me and that did not change anything and i decided to go to a local bike shop and take it apart and they verified along with me that it was uh, contaminated uh, and I don't know if you can tell the uh, fitting here looks like it's cross threaded they even said that they looked and they said whoever installed it they um, they installed it improperly so I contacted Volcon and put in the paperwork for for this um, I, I, I just I went ahead the part is cheap and I'm going to put it down in the description. I went ahead and bought the brake pads anyway because I want to ride the bike and I didn't want to wait on Volcon. So, again, descriptions below. Now, to adjust them, you just got to loosen these up and then you got to play around with them. I'm not going to show you how I, how I adjust it, but right now it's, it's perfectly straight. Now, these right here will, uh, when you take it out, will remove the caliper and that's how you get to the... Uh, brake pads along with this cotter pin you take it out the kit that you get with the brakes come with everything new including the cotter pin and then the little uh sleeve that, that aligns them now moving on to another issue that i found out once this was resolved the noise went away in the back and i was very happy i was very happy brakes went away but then i started noticing a click 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 that's when i looked in front and I saw that the rotor was uh, not straight. It wasn't, it wasn't, um, I don't know. I don't know if it was the alignment. So that's why I messed with the alignment and see if I can and fix it. But no, it wasn't the alignment. Then later on, I was like, you know what? Maybe the rotor is warped. I lifted up the bike, I spun the wheel and, and you can see that it, it was just tapping on the brake pad. So wherever it wasn't true, it was tick, 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 tick. The rotors warped. So the front rotors warped. I contacted Vulcan, put in war uh, warranty paperwork on that one. <laughs> the rotor in the back is good, but the brake pads were bad. And then the caliper wasn't aligned properly, and the, I mean, not the, the, the caliper, yeah, the, the caliper, and then the, the fitting was, was installed improperly. So, I mean, come on, like, less than 30 miles and I have these issues already with the bike. I really like the bike. The, light, the bike is so cool. And I don't want to give them crap or anything like that, but I just want to let everybody know, hey, you can, like, I went ahead and I found the rotors online, you, on Amazon. These, are, they look the same. These are 180 millimeter uh, rotors front and back. They're 180, 188, I'm sorry, 180 millimeter rotors front and back. And uh, the brake pads, they're, they're Shimano e-bike brake pads. I think they're 
uh, B05S's or B50S's, something like that. Again, I'm gonna put the the, uh, the part uh, in the description below. Um, besides that, the the only issue um, that I didn't mention, which I don't think I'm gonna also tell Vulcan because it's not a big deal, is some of the the wiring. I don't think it's long enough, so it if you if you turn you can hear it like it's tightening and my fear especially after all the little things that i've discovered it might end up messing up or tearing up the uh the wiring so i i i kind of try to adjust the wiring so i can give it some slack but you know at this point i'm gonna let it be not a big deal i I like the bike. Let me see. I, I I got it right here. I got the part. I'm gonna show you the before I I stop the video. Here it is. This is the uh, brake pads. Oh yeah, disc brake Shimano resin e-bike rated B05S. Let me wipe the lens. I think I got sweat. I was sweating all day trying to figure this thing out. So. Uh, before I end the video, I'm going to also put uh, videos of um, the bike squeaking and then I'm going to put a video of after the brakes were replaced so you can hear the difference and hopefully in that, in that video you should be able to hear the front brakes like tapping and making that clicky noise. Obviously, I, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm happy, as you can tell. I'm really happy. Um, these are little minor things that can be fixed. Not a big deal. So, I'm not going to give Vulcan a hard time. Just want people to know and understand that um, this is something that's very common in the bike community and in the bike industry. Not motorcycles, I'm talking about bicycles. When you get something, sometimes things are not installed properly or are not aligned because we are all human things happen um so yeah uh thank you for watching and uh y'all have a good one Peace.